More news tonight coming from the Attorney General's office. Democrats are calling for an investigation into how Loudoun County schools handled two sexual assault cases, and they're calling it rigged and politicized. They say emails obtained by 8 News raise ethical concerns in the AG's office. Capitol Bureau reporter Jackie DeFusco is live with what we found and what's behind this probe. Jackie, good evening. Hey guys, well, you'll remember Governor Glenn Youngkin requested this investigation as one of his very first executive orders after accusations that Loudoun County Schools attempted to cover up sexual assaults, which officials there have denied. But tonight, Democrats are basically questioning the integrity of this probe as Republicans say that critics are just trying to get in the way of the truth. Today, two Democrats representing Loudoun County urging Attorney General Jason Meares to reverse course. The Attorney General has made it clear that this will be a rigged, politicized investigation. This is the AG's office investigates how school officials handled two sexual assault cases involving the same student last year. They are going to get the outcome that they wanted for political motivation. I would prefer to see if we're going to do an investigation that it be an independent investigation outside of the scope of the attorney general's office at this point. I'm very disappointed. Those comments come in response to this email we obtained on Thursday. In January, a special assistant involved in the probe writing, quote, when the Loudoun County investigation wraps up in a few months, assuming it is done well and the AG looks good, as is the hope slash expectation on my end, as mentioned a couple of times, I'd be very interested in working with the university counsel's office. The email sent less than 10 days after an attorney who previously held that position in the counsel's office was reportedly fired. This all happening while he was also investigating the January 6 riot at the U.S. Capitol. Miares not sharing a specific reason for the firing in a past interview, but saying it had nothing to do with the insurrection. Responding to the backlash, Republican Senator Jill Vogel defending the integrity of the AG's investigation in Loudoun County. And we should let them find what they find and not stand in the way and not posture and not make this political. And anybody who does should be embarrassed and should be called out for it. Now, Attorney General Miara is not agreeing to an interview tonight, but a spokesperson for him saying that this investigation will continue, that it will uncover the truth, and denying that it is politically motivated, pointing out that a Democrat is actually leading the probe. Live at the Capitol tonight, I'm Jackie DeFusco, 8 News.